Pursuant to House Resolution 43, the gentlewoman from Puerto Rico, Ms. Gonzalez Colon, and a member opposed to each will control five minutes. The chair recognizes the gentlewoman from Puerto Rico. Thank you, uh, Madam Chair. And today I rise as a designee of Congresswoman Amata Radwan from American Samoa for offering the amendment to increase the nutritional assistance funding amount of the bill by $5 million so the bill can include American Samoa in the emergency appropriation due to the damages caused by Cyclone Gita, Gita in February of last year. The, the entire 100 mile, per hour, the, the 100 mile per hour winds of Cyclone Gita wipe out an entire growing season for the American Samoa people in rural communities, which largely depends on of subsistence in farming. Staple crops of bananas, breadfruit, and taro, taro were lost wholesale, which led to enormous drain on the island's small nutritional assistance grant. These funds are vital to sustain the basic local population and help fulfill the basic nutritional assistance needs of the American Samoa population. By approving this amendment, approximately 6,000 people in the territory will benefit and will have a greater access to food security. And I do believe that including American Samoa in the disaster bill will do uh, what, they, what the people need in that island. I ask for your support for this emergency provision to benefit the people of American Samoa on behalf of Congresswoman Amata Radewagen. With that, I reserve the balance of the time. The gentlewoman reserves. <laughs> 